Hey guys, how you doing? Here is me, Young Leo here. Look what I have here today for dinner. This is actually called sticky rice dumpling. We're having sticky rice dumpling on the weekend here. And let me tell you a little bit about it, uh, the ingredients and so on. And then uh, I'll cut it off and uh, shoot another one when I'm actually make everything ready to make another shooting again and taking picture also, okay? So basically, uh, this is called uh, sticky rice dumplings and my people made it, uh, my mom made it, and uh, we're here eating um, dinner with this. It's actually a good meal, uh, you can be full with it. It's actually a vegetarian uh, sticky rice dumpling. Uh, well, it is, um, it is all vegetarian, you know, unless you want to add any other, like, shrimp or meats or whatever, but usually it's uh, vegetarian. So basically, the sticky rice dumpling is here. This is what it's called. It's uh, white flour um, with starch flour, I guess. Um, I forgot, like, what type of flour, but it's basically, you can uh, Google it or so if you're trying to make this uh, sticky rice dumpling balls here. It looks like dragon balls, right? Well, it's white and white flour. Um, you can use some oil to roll it up, you know, make it a ball, but uh, it's vegetarian, what we're making here. So basically, we don't put any oil. Instead of oil, we put water to roll it up. And the, what's inside of the um, sticky rice uh, dumpling ball here is uh, that uh, it has green bean in there, cooked, fully cooked green beans, smashed it. It's like mashed it, cooked green beans in there. Um, green, yellowish looking, delicious green beans. Um, uh, it's a regular green bean that you can buy like in a pack and just you know cook it with water and smash it up like mashed potato. And then just um, after you uh, mix the flour, um, just put the, a ball of green beans after it's cooked and just put it inside of a flattened uh, flour. And then just put the green bean the cooked green bean uh, onto the flour and then just roll it up in a ball, cover the green bean with the flour here and that's what it makes these sticky rice dumpling balls here. All right, so what we have here within the ingredients, the sticky rice dumpling we eat it with um, some sauerkraut, like we call it, you know, you can say sauerkraut, but really it's carrots, sour carrots that's been in with uh, I, I don't know vinegars or so just make it sour you know and this is like uh, another kind of white cabbage to make the sauerkraut so these two are sauerkraut and then um, we have some coconut milk here with some uh, chopped up chai's onion in there um, it has to be cooked too um, you don't want to eat it, you don't want to eat it raw because uh, <clears throat> you know it's not good so we have some vegetable um, these are green sprout beans bean sprout whatever you want to call it uh, these are some Roman lettuce and just any type of um, Asian um, like uh, any type of Asian uh, vegetable will be fine like uh, pers uh, parsley or um, peppermint leaves that's fine and look we have here after that we're gonna put um, fry red onions uh, just a spoon or two of that on top of it uh, put in the uh, coconut milk and basically just mix everything in the last thing you would want to have is the sauce Okay, these um, Vegetarian sauce. Okay, vegetarian spice sauce. Okay, it's called special sauce for vegetarian and it's, it's, it's you can see the peppers there and it's spicy. Okay, but it's for vegetarian so You know, you don't eat meat with that kind of sauce. Okay, it's all vegetarian all right, guys, I'm going I'm to end here, and I'm going to come back after I make it and let you guys see how it is, all right?